Welcome back to Top Teens TV. I'm Kendall B. at Denver's Civic Center Park, enjoying a, a nice, relaxing, comfortable day on the bench here and meeting some fantastic teens. We were talking about the Second Wind Fund. It is a fund that goes towards helping teens to prevent teen suicide. They're going to remove all barriers as far as counseling goes, as far as any financial problems. They are doing it through their fundraising efforts. We met Gage a little while ago, who's done some great fundraising on behalf of a friend who passed away. Now let's meet Kira, who's also doing the same thing spreading the word to make sure that we can keep all of our teens all nice, happy, and healthy and right here with us. Let's meet Kira. My name is Kira Gressman. I'm a senior at Lakewood High School. I'm a member of the International Baccalaureate program here and I spend a lot of my time um, either in the band room playing French horn in this tech room uh, working on Hunch, which is high school students united with NASA to create hardware. And I also love working with different organizations like Invisible Children to help child soldiers in Uganda and Second Wind Fund, which is a local teen suicide prevention organization. I got involved with Second Wind Fund in my sophomore year. One of my teachers here, actually my chemistry teacher, her husband was a founder of Second Wind Fund. When I go off to college, I'm hoping to do a concentration in pre-medicine and a minor in uh, international relations because one day I hope to join Doctors Without Borders. The cool thing about being a teenager is that you have, you have the rest of your life to look forward to and you have a lot of time to explore and it's an exciting time in people's lives that they, they have all these opportunities in front of them, which again is really cool um, getting to work with Second Wind Fund because it makes sure that teens get to know that and that they understand that they have that whole future ahead of them. As a teen ambassador, my job is to represent my generation and kind of give a voice to uh, our perspectives on teen suicide and um, talk to adults and teens to educate them and bring awareness that it's okay to talk about suicide and if you need help that there's Second Wind Fund as a resource to provide free one-on-one -on -one counseling with a licensed therapist and that way um, teens who are at risk for suicide can learn to cope with their thoughts and then they can um, have a brighter future. When you're a teenager, your friends are a very, very strong support system. So if you're a teenager and you see that something is wrong or you know your friend is going through a rough time, make sure you're there for them because especially when you're a teenager, I know that it's really easy to become uh, isolated and feel like you're the only one going through this but the fact is that one in four teens every single year deal with more than a passing thought of suicide and that's that's 25 percent that's a lot of teenagers so no one is going through this alone and there's organizations like Second Wind Fund that have the resources that can help. I know plenty of people who've dealt with suicidal thoughts in my own family, with my own friends, and it's something that affects everybody. It affects the entire community and it affects the entire world. So knowing that I have the chance to help and impact this situation in a positive way, it's just been amazing and it's helped me grow as a person. It's not an easy topic, but it's necessary that it's that it's not taboo because if no one talks about it then people can't get help and the first step to dealing with suicidal thoughts is actually talking about it and get that's the only way you can get help. The teens of today are the future lawyers, doctors, parents, teachers, they're the future of tomorrow and as cheesy as that might sound it's 100% true and if we can build a stronger youth um, by making sure that the teens of today can cope with the hardships of life then we'll have a stronger world in general in the future and we'll have stronger diplomats and we'll have stronger teachers and stronger doctors who can solve problems. 
working with the people in Second Wind Fund, everyone has so much hope and they have a right to because there's a 100% survival rate for all of the students and teenagers who've gone through this program and it proves that teen suicide is 100% preventable and that's a really awesome thing to know because we can do something about it. And just the fact that we have the resources and we know exactly how to solve this issue, it's, it's a very optimistic thing. And as soon as we can get this word out to everyone and make sure that everyone knows that we have this resource, it, it uplifts the entire community. Thank you, Kira, for spreading the word. You know, the Second Wind Foundation, they have helped out about 2,300 teens, if not more, from 300 different schools all throughout the state of Colorado. So they're doing great things. If you want to help, want to find out more information, all you have to do is go to our website, topteenstv.com. You'll find their link and their information right there. When we return, we're going to have magic, a young Denver magician who could be the next big thing in illusionary -is ism if that's a word. That's coming up on Top Teens TV.